expenses to get into this industry. I'm not really old in the school years, like I get to um, adapt somewhat to the new uh, technology. So, uh, the MD and also the uh, medical team can be um, music industry or from uh, some kind of tested with respect to CD and MD disease. Um, but still using some sort of physical medium uh, in that industry. And uh, these types of changes really lead to some sort of food in the companies that are well established, the leading companies in the market. Um, because uh, it's a sustained improvement in the economy and something to that. But the disruptive places are different in the characteristics. Um, they are uh, like a whole new type of technology, a new place. And the technology may have other properties that we can't extend to, more like a robust, smaller, lighter, more flexible, easy to maintain, easier to use. Um, so it's like opening up the um, way to new markets. So, what we mean by new market initially is not the future is of the product itself, but we mean the customer who you're selling to. So, I know if you're I sell to a whole new group of people, you have a new market. So, you might just find people that have purchased uh, on many computers. So, because there are people that have been using to explore what else. Usually, large organizations, companies, and then uh, the companies are the family for their employees, and they would be in control of the technology. But when the PCs come out, the new market was the end user, and this was a whole new group of people to sell to. So, this was the opening for the new technology. <coughs> New markets provide good income, they are revenue, highly useful new research and development. So, um, because you get um, a lot of money from the new customers that nobody else has, you get the uh, extra profit and revenue that you can use for uh, developing technologies and further. So, sometimes the new technologies in the new markets. To be in place on the traditional market. So the new, uh, all the PCs, would, uh, they were first getting money from the end users. And then eventually the PCs became stronger and stronger and better and better. And then eventually uh, they, the same type of technology moved into um, the business domain. They're able to do as much as the traditional means and to do the support. So you have some small systems. So I can see that they can also do the same thing as the means and to do the support. So the development to all of the good of the technology is also assisted for the traditional market. So that means that. When it gets to the technology is better, it gets also when it gets to the new market, it just becomes a place to take the good time to the set. Uh, but since the new deceptive technology has numerous other benefits, it will undermine the market for the traditional product. So before when you had the, the, the PC market, so there's more users, the new market for the PC users, when it gets uh, the PC gets better, it goes into the into the mini market as well, and then eventually uh, it goes to the mini market because it's so much better, it's more affordable, it's education for the traditional market. Therefore, we have uh, almost no mainframes in the kitchen, cable operators, excavators, physical registers as well, because the new technology took over all the existing markets to the old technology. Thank you.
to operate it, and they were escorting it to the state to get the drug. And so, the company has invested a lot of money in this type of thing. The advice we came from the first introduced, they were small and flexible, so it was a common system. And then they took the cancer to a third and they were reliable. So they were very good technology. But they were not able to see once they sold these things and ask the question, do you want something that's small? They don't want something that's small because they have to use the word to test it. But this was actually a, we found a new market. So we used to do this. Other people who needed something that was small and stuff, but I'm not too close. So eventually, um, excuse me, excuse me, and I'm not too close. They only made a small, uh, small activities. And uh, eventually, the technology improved and it was limited to this bigger capacity. So the new uh, technology improved all of the systems between technology. We ended up taking the most of it. So, if I was going to think of this topic, I would say that we would have very much less capacity. And if I was going to say that the company is very much the benefit, and the new company can now buy technology, and we thought it would be able to provide it, and they would put the chances to put the technology in. And they can really not be. And then eventually, um, some technology improved. So, as far as technology underwent self development, they became so bigger capacities. And uh, new markets, so uh, they won the new markets to solve them in the new established market. And then uh, they had to change uh, how most of the established planes actually pay for it. Could they have done anything different? How they knew the technology? And they can call it out the same as any other solutions to the system customers. They were still developers, so they locked them to establish custom devices. And unfortunately, they had to use the technology that customers did not need. And you can see this with other companies using the same technology. So they can see that they're going to use cable. Um, so, in other words, they, from what they could see, it was like satisfying the customers in this new mobile technology that they had to need. Um, so, the question is uh, what does not work against the public technology? And that is the uh, work from harder, putting in more hours and effort in smarter. Uh, listening to your customers, investing more effectively, developing the technology. All these things didn't work just because they were uh, investing in the existing technology. Uh, they were uh, investing in listening to the existing systems. And even though you pour more money and resources into the existing, it wasn't um, investing in the new needs. Most of these um, developments follow the same kind of pattern. Okay, so this is the, some of the, the key points that I would really get out of this. And that is how the structure of the infrastructure of the technology, how did they develop? Um, first of all, to have um, a new disruptive technology, some kind of new technology developed within an established company. You also need that the company has a a lot of money for research and development. And the development of technology make it better. So they might come up with um, some smaller bits over time. And this is, um, would be within an existing company. And it's because it makes, they want to make this technology improvement. But they may see that some of these technology improvements are not what they need from the customers. So, um, the existing company, the established company, will ask the customers what they need 
And um, what did I say? He reached four times the fact. So I think, okay, I'm not going to do anything to the technology because uh, it's not going to produce any revenue. Um, and then the third step is that we established uh, something focused on the development of existing sustained technology. So uh, this is usually determined by the feedback from the customers of the large company. Uh, so the, the customers want the right to have the system. And uh, in order to keep their revenue coming, they have to satisfy the existing company, the existing company. So um, instead of uh, focusing on the new technology that they did research in, they actually focus on the improvements to the existing technology. And then the new company that formed it from the new technology because uh, this new technology exists and, and people see opportunities for that. Uh, but they know they can sell to the existing customers because they don't need that in order to they don't need that. So then they try to sell to new customers. And to try and error, maybe they Selling from markets and developing new markets with for the new technology, and then the new technology develops for larger capacity, meaning it improves. The new technology gets better over time, and uh, so then the new technology market can increase in size and start to capture some of the customers from the existing market from the old technology. So this. Um, the capabilities uh, for the new technology can become greater, and then they can get the customer needs of the company to market to the existing market. And then number six, uh, the established uh, company tends to, uh, tends to defend the market to try to keep the customers, and they see that the new technology is also introduced into their market. And it's not in their high capacity, the high demand customer. And then they uh, try to do something like they prototype or um, make prototypes, but make their existing technology better so that they can hold on to the existing customer. But the new companies often have an advantage here because they have the unstated market for the new technology, and then people go over to this new technology market. So the established companies often move out to the new company. And then again, this is what happens when you take this and see it and then So, um, how do you handle a market where you see disruptive technology? Um, Know about the new technology. It's the new, the new technology about that new product. And then you have to be willing to develop um, and, and have the ability to develop the new technology for new customers, as well as the need to develop the sustained technology. So you kind of have to do both. You need to develop the new technology and you need to develop the sustained technology. And then you need the willingness to set new forms of market. You have to think that what works in one market may not work in the new market. You have to try a different type of marketing for the new market. And the willingness to set new forms of marketing means that because you will have a lot of income from the existing market, you're going to get a lot of income from the new market. You have different expectations uh, for the new market. And the willingness to Terminate the uh, existing staff and find new employees instead. So the people who work for your company might have been good in uh, hardware design. And you need people that are good in software design. So therefore, you should, uh, if you have to cut people, cut people from the old, and that needs to be, this needs to be the new one. And because there's not that many examples of 
old companies that have to buy new pages by the end of the session. And um, so uh, I began that day and then I went into the weekly market. And also, I began with making five and three and five and three and eight and eight and eight and eight and eight and eight and then the best uh, solution often is to try the new company. So you might have in time companies that have different divisions. One goes to new technology, one goes to new technology. Different people with different sets of skills, and different ways of marketing, different education, and with two divisions. Because often the best approach is to get to get a new company. I think that's a new technology. So many companies therefore start Somebody who stood up in the technology and looked at the new of the They were not just a bunch of stuff. They were left on the new technology. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the internet is uh, it is technology that is unknown to them. Allows for uh, new sites and uh, new transactions. Uh, but it may not be um, in terms of the first user. And the internet is very, you know, it's very broad and specific in terms of the way to do it. An example of uh, the tradition industry that provides the uh, new technology is similar to its process. And uh, there are something um, several things that are very expensive. And they have quality and finance and mm, quality and the function. And this is the internet itself. And when digital watches got introduced, it's very cheap and you can have a watch, but they didn't have this static value that very cool way. So uh, the traditional company really needed to yeah, separate the characteristics of this. And um, they can make something that is. Uh, Good quality and they can make a digital watch, but they can have other features and things like that. Um, and they can they can live on this. They can make a lot of numbers and they can make a lot of quality people. And many people that are uh, interested in using watches. They don't care about the functionality. You know, they can put it on because they can use the time. Because you can get the time in your own <laughs> But it uh, didn't happen because they are maybe obsessed and they were. Um, um, I will watch this movie because I've always been in the light. But they didn't mean that I still have to remember to change the time. Whereas if it's a little more of a piece of the box, they don't have to think about it. Mm -hmm. It takes a lot of it. Mm -hmm. He says that uh, the fact that technologies are not that common, uh, but in many industries in technology can have an acceptable effect on the business. So it's always the investors for the system, system, uh, numerical control machine, to manufacturing, IT and in telecom, mobile technology, internet. Um, so, like having internet in the telecom industry has changed the market that can bring the best. Um, the lens from the telecom and city to start with. Um, and internet in banking came out for the healthcare industry. They used to do some subdivision. People get more sick than they might need to be used to. Some people can do this and some people choose to do this. And then digital cameras completely changed the camera industry. So we don't have film now. Mm -hmm. And then the several prognosis is from a uh, by time and this is probably in 2018 with this because it's harder to disappear and then to keep the form. The collection surfaces long to be irrelevant and they just put it And 
have property, cars, folks, and general stuff in the mortgage, and then you can do something, and you can do a purchase or something. So, no need to go to the So, that's the discussion. And then, I want to put this away from you. And we come back to talk about the in 2015, so this was kind of made in 2015, and then we looked at how we can get from 2015, so this was some highlight points in our lives, and we took it to 